What is up guys, Nick here today, and bring you another episode of the Road to Max Cape series. Bam, 81 fishing, holla at your boy. This shit takes fucking forever. Lobsters, my god, they take so long. But anyway, we're gonna start off this episode by selling random shit. Um, selling some energies, my beautiful swamp lizards, that's so much money, and then some random rock tails and rune ore that I got from challenges. Um, so just selling them, getting them out of my bank. Uh, some easy cash as I begin to embark on the new journey of going for 1k total level. And we will start by doing the skill called, uh, drum roll please, Herblore. Herblore, Herblore, however the fuck you say it, wherever the hell you live. Um, I don't really care how you say it, it's the same fucking thing. Um, but I had a shit ton of double XP for it um, from the festive cracker shits. So I decided to go ahead and get working on that. I had a ton of extra money. As you can see, the cash stack, it was closer to 2.5 mil for what I invested into getting my herb or lore level up. So, um, yeah, that diminished very fucking fast. It's very expensive to do herb lore. Even just the regular levels, um, like the basic levels, just making shitty potions. I was making anti-poisons and they're like 30 GP each. Energy potions are like, they might as well just be 1 GP each, to be honest. Um, as you can see, also I have invested, actually that's where the rest of my cash went as well. Um, I spent about 4 to 5 mil invested, <coughs> God bless you Kevin, um, <laughs> into making emerald necklaces. I had 4,000 that I intended on making, um, that would get me some crafting levels that you'll see also in this video, um, and also make some money so I could also get up more herbal levels as well. So, that was kind of my intentions on this episode. I really wanted to push for the 1k total level, as you can see in the title. Um, I do obviously achieve it. So you'll see all of the fucking grinding going on in this. I don't want to say gains because that's an Alkin thing. So grinding, the grind is my thing, I guess. Um, oh, excuse me. So this is probably the fastest turnaround I've had to two videos in a row, I think, for this series. It literally took me one day, January 8th, I did all of these levels, um, except for, I think, two levels at the way end. I got really early this morning at, like, 1 or 2 in the morning. Um, so I just went on an onslaught on these fucking skills. I really wanted to get them done. Uh, that way, I have more balanced stats. It's kind of the intention, anyway, to get balanced stats and eventually get there. Um, but as a skiller, I don't know how I'm going to get all of these herbaler levels up to, like, 85, 80, or something like that. Um, without having to boss for money because it's so it's so prolonged to make all of that money to be able to afford making this shit and um, Yeah, I, I don't know how I'll do it. It's gonna be a grind. That's for sure. I might have to do swamp lizards from uh, My hunter level now all the way to 99 then I'll be able to afford to do it or uh, fish sharks from Now till 99 which is close to like 70 80 thousand of them um, fucking terrible XP probably take me from now till next January, but, you know, it'll get done and sometime. I'll get one skill to 99. Still have combat not even started. But, yeah, I'm just fucking with it. Um, so, I have a lot of shit that I'm working on right now. Obviously, the herbal levels were my main concern. I wanted to get them up to a respectable level where I can definitely make, like, my own uh, money-making saving ways. So, saving money and doing the stats at the same time. Um, which goes along with Herblore getting up farming. So you will see that later in this video as well. I get up my farming level uh, so I can start to make my own herbs and shit. My, make my weed. Gotta get a steady flow of the herbs in here. Fucking Colorado in this bitch. Alright, so then we used uh, a huge XP lamp on agility. I've been doing this forever since I started doing that daily thing in the bird and the beast, beast and the bird, whatever the fuck it is, uh, bees? no, not the birds and the bees, um, so I got up to 45 agility, and, um, went back to doing my grand old thing and doing herbs, so I finally got all my renars and snap, snape, snape grass, snap, yeah, snape grass, um, so I decided to go ahead and make some prayer potions, that way I'd at least have some sort of money back from what I'm making, that way I can sell uh, the potions back for a little bit of income, not even income. I maybe made half the money back 
and just getting to 44 as you can see right down there at the cash stack I only have 1.6 mil left I spent over 900k getting 1 to 44 and 45 isn't any better uh, I freaking look at where's my cash at now it's gone 167k all I have left Irits are so expensive and I'm just gonna say this now I'm gonna try to make a money-making guide to see how much you can turn around from like a hundred irit seeds to however many herbs you get from it um, because irit seeds are 200 GP each 200 GP each the fucking clean irit is 2.7 K my god that's like 13 times what it's actually worth from the seed and you get it over and over and over again when you farm it so um, I'm definitely gonna do a shit ton of irits kind of a bit I can't fucking talk I'm kind of no matter what level my herb lore is I plan on even though I can make super strength potions now well in about maybe 30 seconds I'll be able to make them for you guys uh, but I can make them now so I'm probably just gonna stick with super attack potions because I can make everything it'll almost be free herb lore XP because I'll be making I can the eye of newts are fucking like what six GP each and if I spend, um, if I buy 100 seeds for Irits, I will spend about, I don't know, 20k. And with that 20k, then I turn that into 23k just in, like, taking or collecting two sets of herbs. So it's fucking ridiculous. So it's my plans for the next episodes to come, just to stay on my farm runs. And I literally got 19 to 44. I believe 19 to 44 farming in one night literally yesterday I just did my herb or my farm runs and yeah the gains the grind was real I was fucking farming like an animal like I'm from the mid United States I was doing my thing doing my thing and so it was kind of cool to be able to get back in I haven't done farm runs in a long ass time um so it was really cool uh also been seeing a lack of people in the French chat. Come on, guys, where you at? I'm sitting there chilling, doing my thing. Um, so if you guys feel like joining the French chat, feel free to do it. I'm not saying you have to. Um, it's just been a lot of a lack of people. Some other guy, some random guy, I've never seen in the French chat before joined. He's like, so is this it? Three people? I looked at it, I was like, huh, where the fuck is everybody? You guys just left me alone in there. But it's whatever, I really don't give a shit. I know you guys probably have more interesting people to talk to. I just kind of chill and do my thing. Um, so you're always welcome to join. Otherwise, don't even worry about it. I'm just kind of hanging out. Um, so still doing my farming. Right now, I'm going to put in a song for a little while. I really don't have much to talk about since I literally just uploaded the other day. Uh, two days ago. So I really don't have much else to talk about. Nothing's really new besides me going on my farming grind. And herbal grind. So I will come back um, closer to the end of the video. And so I hope you guys enjoy the music for a little while. If it's silent in dismay, it won't break this feeling down. If I conquer this my way, I'd devour, I'd surround. If it hurts you just a little, then it heals you when it's done. Disappointment is the anchor, resolution is the sun.
silent in dismay It won't break this feeling down If I conquer this my way I devour Alright guys, well I am back And time for the prayer fucking onslaught of levels Uh, so one of my daily challenges was to Get, um, 15 big bones Either uh, I bury them or use them on a gilded altar I opted to use them on a gilded altar I also had double XP from the festive R shit, or the festive cracker things. So, I ended up getting from 11 to 17, just from the 15 alone. And, um, then I went and turned in my fancy little challenge thing. And so, uh, this is kind of when I decided to plow through my levels. I did decide I would get prayer up, because it doesn't affect your combat level anymore, like it used to prior to EOC. So, I have 18 prayer now. So, that's another thing that's going to be expensive as fuck, but we can get on that later. Uh, so I had to do 20 more uh, Mithril Ore. I got the level, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is 1,000 total level. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, favorite, subscribe. Um, as always, uh, I will come out with another video as soon as I get substantial progress done. I felt like I got a shit ton done in one day, especially. And I also want to shout out to Cybold, my friend CJ, for the 25k Astral Runes. Thank you very much, bud. Um, until next time, guys, thank you very much for watching. And if you did, like the video like favorite subscribe leave any comments uh, for me to um, reference later in another video or even after the video anyway see you guys later